Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So you can tell by the background today and my outfit and everything, I am feeling the autumn vibes. I've actually been feeling the autumn vibes since like the end of July. <laughs> I actually decorated my room like a long, long time ago, but I just love autumn so much. It is my absolute favorite time of year. And today's video, I thought it would be fun to show you guys some of my favorite items that I have been using. Um, some items I've been wearing and eating as well, and I just thought it'd be fun to share that. Um, people are always asking me to share more about myself, so I thought that'd be really fun. Also, if you guys can find some of these things where you are, then I guess you could try them as well. Um, I sometimes tend not to try new things unless somebody that I know recommends it to me, so maybe you guys will be that way too. But anyways, I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys the first item now. So the first item I wanted to share with you guys is this Good Earth Sweet and Spicy Flavored Herbal Tea. Now I am not a huge herbal tea fan at all. I don't know what it is. Sometimes I find them kind of a little bit odd, but this one is like so cinnamon and it has um, cinnamon, chicory root, rose hip, lemongrass, peppermint, chamomile, anise seed ginger root, orange oil, and orange peel, and it is such a good combination. I actually went into my doctor's office this past week and it smelled so good in there. It was like really cinnamon, and I thought it was like an oil diffuser or something, so I asked them, you know, what kind it was, and they showed me one of the packets and had me smell it, and it was just this tea, and it smells up my whole office. It smells so good, so I really, really like this stuff for autumn. It's obviously autumn flavors with the orange and the cinnamon, but um, if you guys are into tea, you can try this. I also really like the fact that it's caffeine free because I'm supposed to be watching my caffeine intake right now and not having caffeine to heal my body, so um, that's really good. So the next thing I am going to show you guys is this um, aromatherapy oil, and I just got this from Kohl's recently. It was on clearance. You can see the clearance tag on it. And I've been really, really big into self-care the past many months. Um, I've just been learning how important it is to take care of yourself because if your body is not looked after and you're not taking care of yourself, then you're not really able to give out to other people either. And I've been really understanding that importance. So I've been big into like relaxation and all of that. Um, I've been using aromatherapy oil for the first time in my life. and. This is probably like one of my favorite scents ever. Um, it has lemon, lime, lemongrass, rosemary, and I don't know how you pronounce it. It's like linalo wood or something, but it is like so refreshing. It's not just boring lemon smell and it doesn't smell like something you would clean with, which is like, I'm really picky when it comes to lemon stuff, but this is just so nice and refreshing. Now, I will say if you have pets, please don't use this sort of thing because um, I hear that aromatherapy oil can be dangerous with pets. Um, obviously, when I get a pet again, I won't be using it, but I just wanted to share that with you guys. So the next item is also something that I found recently at Kohl's, and I've been needing a brown backpack because I really like wearing backpack purses. That way I don't have to like hold them. So I wanted to have a brown one because I have so many like outfits I wear with brown and boots and stuff. So I found this one and it's a really small one which I like because I don't like wearing something big and heavy on my back. I also would have to say my favorite thing about this is this really pretty design in the front. I'm not sure what to like describe it as but um, it just makes it look not so plain and boring as if it just was plain brown in the front so it had enough like decoration on it but it didn't look too busy and it goes with my brown boots and it also goes with my favorite outfit I've been wearing this autumn which I will talk to you guys about in just a minute but this purse um, I got at Kohl's like I said it was um, on sale and I had Kohl's cash and I had a coupon so I was able to get it for a really good deal. Okay so this next item is really not fall related at all but it's something that I have been reading a lot and this is something that my brother actually got me for my 
birthday, kind of for my birthday, because it was like on my wish list. And it is this book about adrenal fatigue, and it is such a good book. So for those of you who don't know, because I've mentioned my health a lot on my two channels, adrenal fatigue is something that I have been struggling with for a couple of years now. It's really only been um, very intense, like the past year. So I've been wanting to do a lot of reading up on it to learn how I can help myself to um, improve my nutrition and make sure that I'm not eating things that are contributing to my fatigue. So this book is awesome. It's such an easy read. They have a lot of examples throughout, like different example stories. There's some really cute comics as well that I find so funny. And like literally everything in this book, I am just relating to like 100%. It is so awesome. So most of you guys, probably all of you guys who are watching this, likely don't have adrenal fatigue. But if you do and you want to read up more about it and get to learn about the nutrition and things that you're not supposed to eat that make fatigue worse and that sort of thing this book is really awesome and even if you just want to learn more about it and you don't like quite understand what it is this is really good because most medical doctors will not um, agree that adrenal fatigue is a thing so a lot of times you have to go to a naturopathic doctor but this is something that I definitely wanted to mention in this. Okay, so the next item that I want to show you guys is autumn related and it's a food item. Unfortunately, I don't have the actual flavor that I'm wanting to show you guys because I only got one at the store and I ate it already so I didn't save the wrapper, but it is a Lara bar and the flavor that I really like is pumpkin pie and it tasted exactly like pumpkin bread to me, which I love pumpkin bread. This one is a cinnamon roll. This is also one of their autumn uh, like special edition flavors. They also had uh, gingerbread and what was the other one? Oh, snickerdoodle I think was what it was. I wasn't a huge fan of the snickerdoodle. I did like the gingerbread a lot, but I have to say the pumpkin pie was my absolute favorite. So this one, cinnamon roll, I have not tried yet, but I will be trying it later on today. I only have a small amount of these because they are high in natural sugars because they contain dates in them. This is a really good option to have if you want something sweet but you don't want to have all the junk that a candy bar contains. So the next thing, I'm going to have to do an up close shot of this so you guys can see it, but I am wearing my favorite autumn jewelry today. and. First of all, I have these adorable little brown deer earrings, and I don't remember where I got these. I know it was a while back, and I think that it might have been Claire's, but um, I really love wearing these in autumn, obviously, because, you know, it's like deer, and deer always make me think of autumn. The other thing is this necklace that I'm wearing. So the necklace part is silver, and then the charm that is hanging is a gold feather. I've never mixed silver and gold before with my jewelry, but I actually really like how it looks. My next favorite thing is this outfit that I put together that I'm actually wearing today. I've been wearing it quite a few times, and every single time I've gone out and worn it, I've gotten so many compliments on it. So, first of all, I have this brown corduroy hat, and I really like the style of it. I think it looks autumn-y. And then this shirt that I'm wearing is just an olive green. I think they call this a Henley style, I'm not, I'm not sure, but um, I just like the fit of it and then I'm wearing this flowered skirt that I found from Goodwill and it pulled out the green from my shirt perfectly and for boots I have brown boots, again found at Goodwill. I think pretty much everything I wear is like found at Goodwill almost. I really like how this outfit looks, of course I had to put this burgundy colored scrunchie on to match as well. Speaking of boots, because I just mentioned boots, um, I wanted to show you guys my absolute favorite pair of hiking boots. So these I had bought, I believe it was like around Black Friday at Kohl's. They were on sale for a really good deal. These are the Sonoma brand, and these are my absolute favorite hiking boots ever. They are so comfortable. Um, I've had these for, I don't know if it's like four years now, and the tip is just a tiny bit, like the suede on it is worn out a little bit, but other than that, they're still in great shape. They have good support, and I love the look of them as well. So these are my absolute favorite hiking boots ever. Okay, so this next item, or two items I guess I have, um, these are also not really autumn related, but 
October is my birthday month. I did have a birthday and my mom surprised me with some perfume that I had smelled in a store like a while back and oh my goodness, I loved it so much. I was completely obsessed with it. So apparently she knew that. So she went out and got me the um, bottles of perfume. There's two here. I do like to mix them because I feel like it smells better that way. So the first one is the Pacifica French Lilac smell. This literally smells like fresh flowers. It is so amazing. And then I like to mix the Persian Rose with it. Um, this is just a very rich, nice rose. And putting them together, like it smells like fresh flowers mixed with clean shower, like you had just come out of a shower. and. I don't know, it is like the most heavenly smell on earth. So these I've been wearing every single day. I've never had good quality perfume in my entire life. I've always just used the cheap like body mists and they don't last very long. So this stuff lasts a long time and it's very smellable, but it doesn't smell like alcohol. It's like very light and fresh. So I was thrilled with those. Thank you mom for the perfume. And I have one more item I'm going to show you guys. So this I had got at Hobby Lobby, I think it was last year. I did see it again this year, but I got it to put at the end of my bed, the foot of my bed, just to make it look a little bit more autumn-y. And it's really soft, first of all. It's actually a scarf, so you can like wear it as a scarf if you want to. Personally, I hate wearing anything around my neck because it just makes me feel hot and uncomfortable, but I do like this as a bed throw. I've also been using this for like various um, photos I've been taking as a background. I know you guys haven't seen the photos because I take a lot of photos and I just never post them online, but I took one with my point shoes the other day that looked really autumn-y, and I don't know what it is about the print and the colors of this, but it's just really nice and it definitely screams autumn. So. This always makes me feel so cozy every time I look at it. Um, but anyways, those are all of the things I was going to show you today. And I definitely will be doing another one of these videos for winter when I have some new faves that I'm using around winter time. But um, if you have any other video requests that are kind of along this line, let me know. And I will see if I can do them. But thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.